And this is a, a term coming out of the human excellence literature about deliberate practice of focusing on what you don't do well in this kind of disciplined and repetitive way in order to make some real change in how you uh, encounter life. So is, is that what you mean by deliberate practice? Yeah. Yeah, and I love the term, and I think it really applies, because what we don't do well, and it's not our fault, it's our conditioning, it's actually mm -hmm. part of our survival brain, mm -hmm. is that we don't, uh, we're not very good at getting out of our thoughts. I mean, our survival brain has us continue to mull and figure out and be mm -hmm. lost in yeah. thoughts perpetually. So that's mm -hmm. a training that requires deliberate attention. And another thing we don't do so well, again, the survival brain, is we don't learn to stay with the places that are difficult inside us. Mm. And we, we're, we, we don't want to be with unpleasantness. Yeah. Yeah. So there's, there's a wonderful equation that, you know, pain times resistance equals suffering. Well, we keep perpetuating mm -hmm. our suffering because okay. we resist emotional pain. And we have all sorts of clever strategies. We, you know, whether we busy ourselves or distract ourselves or judge ourselves for it, we just keep away from it. So deliberate practice means training ourselves to quiet our mind, to stay with our experience, including stay in our body, because you might be listening right now and notice that you completely lost track of a feeling of being alive in this body and breathing and, and really sensing the vibrancy of life. Well, we dissociate. Mm -hmm. So deliberate practice, coming into the body, coming into the heart, which is the most challenging, we move through the day, and most of us have had um, woundedness, wounds from other people and have insecurities, where we're not really free to love without holding back. We, we, mm -hmm. we, we, we are constantly kind of checking ourselves in some way and protecting. So those are areas that if we commit ourselves to deliberate practice, we actually are serving our own evolution in terms of consciousness. Hmm. 